in the vast expanse of human understanding, we find ourselves at the nexus of thought and reality, where the boundless potential of the human spirit meets the tangible world. This is the crux of conscious creation, a principle deeply embedded in the wisdom of ancient texts, the musings of great philosophers, and the revelations of modern science. The world, as we know it, is not merely a physical realm, but a manifestation of the profound interplay between matter and energy, shaped by the force of our consciousness. To perceive is to exist, and to exist is to perceive. This ancient notion, echoed through the corridors of time by sages and scientists alike, posits that our awareness is the fundamental building block of our reality. Everything you perceive, be it the stars in the night sky or the ground beneath your feet, is a testament to your consciousness. This consciousness acts as the canvas upon which the entire tapestry of your life is painted, with each thought and feeling contributing to the grand design of your existence. Imagination is the ethereal workshop, a domain of boundless potential, where all creation initiates. In this mystical atelier, energy engages in a delicate dance with intention, and ideas emerge as if taking their very first breath. This isn't just a metaphorical landscape. It's a fundamental realm where the seeds of reality are sown and nurtured. Ancient mystics and modern quantum physicists, though their languages and methods differ, converge on this crucial point. Our imagination is a potent bridge that spans the seen and the unseen, the tangible and the intangible. This sacred bridge connects the world of solid matter and concrete experience with the elusive realm of energy and potential. It's where the known meets the mysterious unknown, where the whispers of the universe are translated into the language of human thought and desire. Here, within this divine workshop, we possess the extraordinary ability to shape the formless into formless, into form, to mold the raw, unmanifested energy of the cosmos into concrete manifestations of our deepest desires and highest aspirations. Harnessing this divine tool is an art and a discipline. It requires more than idle daydreaming or wishful thinking. It involves a focused and intentional cultivation of our imaginative capabilities. It's about learning to navigate and direct our inner visions with precision and purpose, using them as a creative force to envision and construct the reality we wish to inhabit. In this process, the imagination becomes more than just a source of escape or entertainment. It transforms into a dynamic creative force, an alchemical furnace where the raw materials of thoughts and energy are transmuted into the gold of tangible results. Through imagination, we become architects of the invisible, sculpting the ether of possibilities into forms and experiences that enrich our lives and the world around us. The power of imagination has been revered throughout history, recognized as a direct line to the divine, a window to the soul, and a portal to higher realms of consciousness. It's the tool through which artists, inventors, and visionaries have glimpsed worlds yet unseen, bringing forth innovations, artworks, and ideas that push humanity forward. It's the same tool that allows each of us to envision a better self, a better world, and a more vibrant and fulfilling life. Yet, the true magic of imagination lies not just in its ability to create what we desire, but in its capacity to expand our very sense of what's possible. It challenges our limitations, stretches our perceptions, and opens our hearts and minds to new horizons. With each imaginative leap, we grow a little more, reaching further into the unknown 
and discovering more of our innate potential. As we engage with our imagination, we engage with the universe itself, participating in the ongoing act of creation that is the heartbeat of existence. We align ourselves with the creative force that pulses through all things, tapping into the same power that spins galaxies and paints sunsets. In doing so, we not only shape our reality, but also deepen our connection with the cosmos, understanding more profoundly our place within the grand, mysterious dance of life. Imagination, therefore, is not just a tool for creation, but a pathway to spiritual and personal growth. It's a journey that takes us into the deepest reaches of our being and the furthest expanses of the universe, reminding us that within our minds and hearts lies the power not just to imagine a better world, but to make it a reality. Desire is the initial spark, the vital ignition in the fire of creation. It's a deep, burning yearning within us, a dynamic force that propels us forward on our journey toward realization. This powerful impulse is more than a mere wish or a passive want. It's an active, driving force, a deep-seated need that seeks fulfillment and expression. It's the starting point of every dream, the first whisper of every innovation, and the underlying drive behind every quest for change and improvement. Yet, while desire is crucial, it alone isn't sufficient to bring our aspirations into reality. It must be fused with belief, a steadfast, unwavering conviction in the inevitability of its manifestation. Belief is the sturdy foundation on which the fire of desire can burn steadily and brightly. It's a deep-seated assurance that what we seek is not only possible, but is almost within reach. A certainty that provides the endurance and resilience needed as we navigate the path toward our goals. This union of desire and belief creates a powerful resonance within the individual, a specific frequency that vibrates in harmony with the universe. It's like tuning into the right wavelength on a radio. Suddenly the static clears, and the signal comes through loud and clear. In a similar way, aligning desire and belief tunes our entire being to the cosmos, enhancing our capacity to attract and create the conditions necessary for the materialization of our thoughts and dreams. This isn't just about wishing harder or believing more intensely. It's about cultivating a deep, genuine alignment between what we deeply desire and what we truly believe is possible. It's about harmonizing our deepest intentions with our highest convictions, ensuring that our desires are not just fleeting whims, but reflections of our true self and purpose. When desire and belief are in sync, they create a dynamic synergy, a force that is greater than the sum of its parts. This synergy sets the stage for the manifestation of thoughts and dreams into physical reality. It's the process through which ideas and aspirations, once mere abstractions, begin to take concrete form, transforming into tangible outcomes and experiences. This process of materialization is not always immediate or straightforward. It often requires time, effort, and persistence, as well as a willingness to adapt and learn along the way. Yet, the underlying principle remains constant. When desire and belief are powerfully aligned, they create a magnetic pull that draws the necessary resources, people, and opportunities toward us, facilitating the journey from conception to realization. Understanding and harnessing this union of desire and belief is a key aspect of personal growth and creative endeavor. It's about becoming more conscious and intentional in our thoughts and feelings, cultivating a mindset and heart set that not only dreams of possibilities, but also firmly believes in their impending arrival. In this way, desire and belief are not just catalysts for personal achievement. 
They are the engines of transformation and evolution, driving us toward a deeper understanding of ourselves and our potential. They remind us that within each of us lies the power not just to dream of a different life, but to create it, to turn the visions of what could be into the realities of what is. It's a journey that takes us beyond the boundaries of our current existence, into a realm of infinite possibilities and potentialities where the fire of our desires, fueled by the strength of our beliefs, lights the way toward realization and fulfillment. In the grand design of the universe, timing is an art form. Every creation, every manifestation, follows its own divine rhythm, much like the cycles of nature. Understanding this natural cadence is crucial for the conscious creator. Just as a seed requires time to germinate, grow, and blossom, so too do our intentions. Patience, then, is not merely waiting. It is active participation in the unfolding of your desires and understanding of the natural ebb and flow of creation. At the core of various teachings, spanning different cultures and eras, is the profound truth of self-realization. The axiom to know oneself is to know the universe, encapsulates a universal wisdom. The inward journey is not just a path to personal insight, but a voyage to the cosmic truth that intertwines individual existence with the broader tapestry of the universe. It's a recognition that within each of us lies a boundless reservoir of power and potential waiting to be discovered and harnessed. This inner sanctum, the deep core of our being, is where the extraordinary unfolds. It's where personal experiences and universal truths converge, where the individual spirit connects with the universal force, and where everyday life meets the extraordinary realms of the divine. This isn't about transcending reality, but about penetrating deeper into it, uncovering the extraordinary within the ordinary. The journey to this sacred space within is unique for everyone, yet it shares a common destination, a state of profound understanding and connection. It's a journey that often starts with questioning, yearning, or seeking something greater than the superficial layers of existence. As we delve deeper into our inner landscape, we begin to peel back the layers of social conditioning, personal fears, and limiting beliefs, revealing the essence of who we truly are. In this quietude, away from the noise and haste of the external world, you encounter the keys to unlocking the infinite possibilities of your life. This isn't just about discovering your personal talents and aspirations. It's about realizing your integral part in the larger scheme of existence. It's about understanding that your thoughts, actions, and being ripple out into the universe, influencing and interacting with the cosmic dance of creation. This realization brings with it a profound sense of responsibility and empowerment. The knowledge that you are a co-creator of your reality and the world around you is both humbling and exhilarating. It shifts your perspective from one of passivity and helplessness to one of active engagement and potential. The path to self-realization is often marked with challenges, doubts, and moments of darkness. Yet these are not just obstacles, but integral parts of the journey. They serve as catalysts for growth, forcing us to confront our shadows, question us to confront our shadows, question our assumptions, and push beyond our perceived limits. They are the trials that test and refine our spirit, leading to greater strength wisdom, and insight. As you traverse this path, you find that self-realization is not a destination, but a continual process of becoming. It's a lifelong journey of learning, growing, and evolving, where each step forward opens new horizons of understanding and possibility. It's a journey that doesn't just change how you see yourself, but how you see the world and your place within it. In this journey, 
the most profound discoveries come not from looking outward, but from diving deep within. It's here, in the stillness and depth of your own being, that you discover the keys to unlocking the infinite potential of your life. Each insight, each revelation brings you closer to the truth of your own nature and the nature of the universe, leading you to a life of greater depth, meaning, and connection. It's a journey, not just to the heart of yourself, but to the heart of yourself, but to the heart of existence itself.